instructing is far out of my comfort zone. It is fun though. It, it's fun, but it is challenging and it really wears you out mentally. But again, it's part of the challenge and really it's helped me to expand uh, as a professional, as an officer, maybe even as a spouse and a father too, when you're talking communicating and maintaining credibility with your message and making that resonate with the, with the receiver of that message. You know, while this isn't our lifelong work and most of the fellows don't have PhDs in the subject matter that they're, they're teaching, it's a unique perspective where we just went through it as a student. So uh, oftentimes with my class, I kind of seamlessly put on the, the instructor hat or the former student hat and, you know, just say, hey, we'll just, you know, pro tip, you might want to do this, especially when you're prep, prepping for class or things of that nature. Um, you know, another thing with getting outside of our comfort zone with instructing, you know, you're balancing that that credibility with peers, but also finding a way, finding a way to articulate the subject matter to them in a manner that resonates. So that's a challenge that I totally underestimated coming here. And uh, that's another way that's really gotten me out of my comfort zone. You don't feel like an outsider. They really bring you in. Um, they're like, hey, you're not a historian. I'm not expecting you to be a historian. They get you ready to instruct your peers. And peer leadership is really challenging. I know we talk about when we walk in as an instructor, I have 13 high speed peers, three of which are international officers. So you really want to do it right. And I think the school does a great job of kind of getting you prepared. Um, and each, each night we come home, we're like, teaching is hard. It's a really, really, but I've loved kind of getting out of my comfort zone and doing something that I will never do in the FSS, you know, community instructing peers on the Vietnam War. It's just, it's very, very interesting and something I've definitely enjoyed. It's interesting, I think everyone's like, oh, take time with your family. You do do a lot of reading. Um, so we're up really late reading, but there's a ton of flexibility built into your schedule. So as a student, you certainly are in the classroom, you know, five days a week for about two hours each day. Um, and then you have all this free time. You, you're like, oh, this is great, this is free time, but you are doing a ton of reading. As instructors, we instruct twice a week. Um, and then we're prepping those others da other days. But I will tell you that the flexibility that's built in is great. Um, it takes a lot of self-discipline to make sure that you're getting your reading done, you're prepping a lesson plan, um, and you're really preparing yourself for your students. But we both um, coached our son's soccer team this year, um, head coach, uh, what were you? Director of Strength and Conditioning. Director of Strength and Conditioning for a five-year-old soccer team. So it was really, really fun. I don't know that we'll get to do that in our next assignment. You know, I don't know that I'll be able to make a five o'clock soccer uh, practice, but we were able to do that for our son. And, you know, the mentors here are like, take this year to coach your kid in soccer. Take this year to, you know, you'll be at the, you know, the ballet recital. Um, that's not to say that this year is not very challenging. It absolutely is. And it's a ton of self-disciplined reading and you really need to prepare that way you're contributing in class, whether it be a student or an instructor. But absolutely, there is a ton of flexibility um, in this year to really be able to do things like coach your kid in soccer um, and make the Christmas pageant. No, I know it's on Wednesday at noon and I get to go. So, um, and the faculty and staff absolutely um, understand that and really try to make sure that this year is not only about personal development um, and really getting into the classroom and thinking harder than you've probably thought in a long time, but it's also great family time um, and just enjoy the area, which we really have.